Hi YouTube, it's Molly, and today I'm here with a kind of unplanned video, but I've been waiting for my Epic Bars for a very long time, and I'm really excited to try them out. So I thought I would do a little review um, on YouTube. I'm just going to try one of them today, but I will do a full review on my blog later. Um, I just don't want to open them all up and then end up wasting them with the amount of food that we eat. So, um, today, I'm going to start doing more reviews, we'll see, but this is one that I have no idea what it's going to taste like, so I kind of thought it would be entertaining to watch that on video, but anyways, this is their little spiel. What if there was a a whole food snack, high in nutrients, low in sugar, 100% grass-fed, just like our ancestors ate. Wouldn't that be epic? Um, so, epic bars come in bison, bacon, cranberry, beef, habanero, cherry, and turkey, almond, cranberry. Um, they're all paleo-friendly, gluten-free, soy-free, dairy-free, um, just like a lot of good whole food ingredients. Um, nutrition wise, some are better than others. I think they're all pretty good, especially considering the fact that they have nuts in them. Um, so obviously that's going to throw your like calorie to protein ratio off a little bit, but it's a healthy fat, so it's good. I'm fine with it. Um, the bison baking cranberry bar has 200 calories. 10 carbs and 11 protein. The beef habanero cherry has 190 calories, 13 protein, and 10 carbs. And the turkey almond cranberry has 150 calories, 14 protein, and 9 carbs. Um, they also have a couple of fiber in them as well. So overall, um, I think for the fact that they do have nuts in them, that their their protein to calorie ratio is pretty good. Um, and would be a good option for, you know, protein and healthy fats. So, I think I'm going to try the turkey almond cranberry one. So this is what they look like in the package. Um, let's see if I can open this package. I've been having trouble with packages today. That smells really good. It smells, I don't even know how to describe it, it smells good. Um, so that's what it looks like. I'm not going to say it looks that appetizing, but it smells appetizing. So, it's definitely different. Is not anything that I can like compare to something else. Um, even though I'm going to try now, but it's got the taste of jerky, but it's not that hard. Um, you know, it, it's softer, more of a. I don't want to say like a Quest bar, it's not like that soft, but it's not like hard like jerky. Um, and then it has the pieces of nuts in there, so you get the crunchy, and um, the cranberry gives it a little bit of sweetness. I think it's really good. Um, and overall, really a, a pretty good option for, for protein that's different than a lot of things I see out there. You know, I, I eat a lot of the same things over and over. I try to mix it up, but this is definitely um, something different. And, you know, this is shelf stable for our, they're good for a year. Um, so in terms of something that like you can throw in your purse, throw in your backpack and take on the run, whatever it is. Um, you know, I always hear people asking like, you know, I'm active, I'm out about doing this or that. What can I take with me? I think this is a really good option. Um, you know, they're not incredibly cheap, but it's one of those things where you get what you pay for, I think. Um, 
definitely a unique product, and I will let you know what I think of the other two flavors on my blog. So I will try to link that below later once I try all of them out. Um, but yeah, I guess that's my little mini review for today. And you can find them at epicbar.com, and I will try to post the link to that below as well. Have a great day, guys.